What if I just- OOH! This is the airport fit. It's a trap star. Trap star. She my trap star. Wait, how does the song go again? Fick, I forgot. One second. I'm having a mental block. <sighs> You're probably wondering why I have so much energy. And that's because this video is sponsored by. upside down out in nano they're a coffee company on the go and you guys know i love my coffee so imagine having coffee on the go you literally just make your coffee like in a cup kind of thing it, it, it has instructions yeah don't take it from me i'm following the instructions yeah you literally just go with your coffee and i've just been surviving on cups of coffee today and that's why i feel like i'm reaching my peak right now and i'm just tired but i don't want to sleep because i need to leave for the airport in two hours Bruh. so like <sighs> I'm barely surviving. If you guys want to check out the company, all, all the information is in the description below. And I am crippling. <gasps> crippling tiredness right now. I'm so tired. But, like, I just need to push through for two more hours before we get to the <laughs> Oh my gosh, I haven't even bought travel insurance. What a mess. I need to buy travel insurance. How am I buying travel insurance like six hours before the flight? <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> I get paranoid because, like, what if I just. <gasps> And then I have to leave my mum to pay for that, like, in a way. And also, oh my gosh, let me rant about this. So, I'm flying for 14 hours straight and direct. No stopover this time yet, because my... <laughs> One second. I just remembered it's my birthday. Let me take this to my advantage and try and get upgraded. <laughs> I have to try and persuade them to upgrade me to first class. If there's any persuasion for them to upgrade me to first class, <coughs> is this thing right here. We do what we have to do for the greater good. And this is my greater good. Because when I say I picked the worst seat on the flight, like how on earth do they expect me to sit here for 14 hours? It's not making sense. No one should be able, no one, no one should be allowed to sit in the middle seat for 14 hours. Oh my god. <laughs> it's not making sense. Like, I have to find a solution because how is my entire flight booked? I know you guys are probably wondering, what, Louise, why are you looking like a sweet thing? Going to see my mom. I'm joking. Uh, that was a joke. You know, that guys, I was literally joking. I would literally tell you if I was like seeing someone. <laughs> type shit, type shit, you know? Expose him! Expose him! <laughs> Anyway, I need to buy the travel insurance. Oh my gosh, I'm getting distracted by you. I'm getting distracted. I need to buy the travel insurance before I'm so tired. Like, my eyes are shining right now. I'm alive, but I'm dead. <coughs> I'm so tired. It doesn't make sense that I literally deprive myself of sleep because my fly is an AM fly for 14 hours. It's literally like my day to day. Like, I could literally just be awake from 9 to 6 and then sleep for the rest of the flight. But I just decided that I want to overdose on sleep and that's why i've deprived myself for a day i've just bought my travel insurance and it says i can get another card and i'm like personalizing this pink revolute card but like i'm half asleep so every time i keep selecting an option i keep going like this i don't, I don't know why <laughs> let me just see I know, this is how I know I'm tired because I'm literally thinking about two things. I thought that I was talking to someone just now. Like, I really thought I was talking to a human being. Like, obviously, I'm talking to you guys on this camera. But I literally thought that there was someone in front of me talking to me. And I was about to answer what they said to me. I need to take it easy otherwise I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to snooze for an hour. This is probably the worst travel job you've ever watched in your life. I'm so sorry sleeping like i'm drunk i'm literally like sleeping like i'm drunk i've never slept on camera like this but i feel like i'm so out of it the way i would have slept off my mom didn't exist bro like 
like sleep almost got me down. I should be downtown with me to you instead. I'm here in my room, but I should be with you. And it's hard to keep my cool, girl, stop running from the truth. I... When it comes to traveling, I'm so dis disorganized, this push, this put. Oh. Anyways, I'm finally at my gate. And I'm like early because they put me through fast track. Because they put me through fast track, I didn't expect to be this early. I was, I was still like expecting a one hour process in the airport, but they literally fast tracked me, barely checked my shit. And yeah, here I am. And then you know, I was doing big bag activities because I bought um, breakfast, lunch, and she gave me a uh, croissant because it was my birthday. I wish I could just get on the plane. Well, this is why I hate being early to the airport, but they always say if you're doing international travel, get to the airport three to four hours before your departure so you have time to do blah blah. And that's exactly what I did. I got to the airport on time. But because I got fast tracked, I just sped up the time so much quicker. <laughs> Who asked? When you need it, they don't give it to you. I'm just thinking about 13 hours, not even 13, 14 hours in the sky. I downloaded bare Netflix shows. I have a lot of videos to edit because I was on my lazy girl shit. I'll play it my favorite. Keep North again. There's something about chocolate croissant, bro. Or maybe it tastes good because it was free. I don't care. It's so good. I know you guys said you want me to vlog Tokyo more because last time I went to Japan, I literally only did like one and a half videos. So this time, I'm gonna try and vlog all the time. But mostly all you'll see is eating. So, pre-warning. So bored. So what happens when you travel solo. Like, I'm not bored of myself. I'm just bored of sitting here, not doing anything. And just the unknown. I can tell this man doesn't travel because he keeps talking to everyone. Why am I sitting in the sun? Why am I actually sitting in the sun though? <laughs> you can let your head down, baby, go and swim. I just don't rap now at the moment. I've been coming way down more often. Yeah, you can come and break down on the morning. You can let your head down, baby, go and swim. I don't know shit now, I've been warning. I go. It was horror like honestly they, it was two options of veg or chicken and i picked chicken you know what british airways are consistent and i i have to rate them for it they're just consistent with really shit food there's not one time i've been on the ba flight and i'm like oh my god this food is banging put me on a lufthansa flight right now please i'm gonna do my nighttime routine so watch me do my nighttime routine it's not even a nighttime routine guys i'm just putting on my bonnet but I just want to make content so I can make this video longer. One second. I'm gonna hang my mic here. Okay, all I need to do is just put this band on, wrap my hair, and then sleep. Because I've been slept for like ages. I feel like I'm still a zombie, but like I'm eating, so that's what's giving me the energy right now to keep going. Okay. How am I gonna wrap this? Purr, purr, purr. Oh. To be honest, I shouldn't be sleeping. I should be editing my videos so that I can get three videos out next week. But that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Don't believe me. I'm a true liar. Oh my god, this arm resting, it doesn't go up and it's so annoying. Good, rolls out. I need to my socks, but this arm resting doesn't go up and it's so uncomfortable and I've got nine more hours left on this plane and I literally want to jump. Actually, not yet. Not yet. 
just gonna wear my socks. I'm just got compression socks on right now. Oh my gosh, imagine like half the time I'm speaking, you guys can't even hear what I'm saying. That'd be so funny. realize that i look refused to learn japanese like the only voices i know how to say is konnichiwa arigato aishimasu and kawaii and i not bad but like really it is bad because i didn't make any change from last time when i went to japan <laughs> anyways i'm gonna sleep for a few hours and then i'm gonna try and edit and then how many hours we have left 10 hours i even lied i thought it was nine hours nine hour 56 minutes i'm thinking maybe i should just jump and what's so shit about this plane is that it doesn't even show us like what country we're over it just has a flight time like yeah! Yeah! anyways bye I'm back like I never left. Like when I was traveling through Tokyo, like I managed to get from Haneda to here just by train, and it literally cost me five pounds. Easy, I got the train, and it could save me so much money. And this is where I filmed the 7 Eleven video right here in this very spot. Like, I feel like nothing's changed. I mean, I've only here a couple months ago, but still, like, you know, sometimes places change really quickly. Not here, it's just still the same, and I'm just I feel like I'm back home. Weirdly enough, I landed super early, like, I was meant to land at seven. That's one. I thought last time when I landed in Japan, it took me two hours to clear through immigration and customs. It took me literally 13 minutes this time. Bruh. So I did not plan this right. Well, we've got the room for another night, for another morning. But it's alright, because that means I can literally have a whole another day in Japan. And then I'll just sleep tonight. Oh my gosh, I'm so, I'm so sleep deprived, but at least I managed to sleep like a tiny bit on the plane. Normally, I never sleep on planes. So I think it's maybe the window seat that makes me not sleep because I slept in the aisle seat. And I just put a towel over my head. So I slept a little bit, like two hours, which is better than none, because that's what I normally do. I remember the first travel vlog to Japan, I did not sleep a wink, because now I have a little bit more energy. And even though I ate on the plane, I'm going to be big back and eat again. This is the place I'm planning to go to, it's like a sashimi place. It's this place, it opens at 11 o'clock, which means I literally have two hours to kill. I'll go there at like 10, and then I'll just chill there. What to do, what to do, what to do, I don't know. I never really planned for this. I thought I was just gonna get to the hotel by three. In Japan, the day starts at 10, 30, 11. I wanna see if they have the strawberry sandos in 7-Eleven. No. There's one down there. Bruh. Oh, I can't wanna get rid of it. Shrimp and mayonnaise, shut the f up, is this new? <laughs> I'm in my room. The time right now is oh my god, finally in my room. It is 1:38. Boy, did I have a day! I quickly hopped over to Harajuku because I wanted to see how much the shoes that I've been dying to get were. And even though they're not exactly, I wanted the Nike Shock Supreme. Even though it's not exactly Nike Shock Supreme, I still like Nike Shock Supreme were retailing for 400 pounds. I found Nike shocks that look like the Supreme for £150, but he said it was a no refund, no exchange policy. So I wanted to be like, be sure, like 100% sure that that's what I wanted to get. And he said that he doesn't think it's going to sell out tomorrow or the day after. So I'll just go back again when I'm in my right mind because the way I was fighting my sleep on the train. Cut the cameras. Dead end. It's embarrassing. Like, I was so embarrassed, but like, there's no way I could stop it. I was like, <laughs> oh my gosh and you know when you get to the point when you're like <sighs> so i was like oh my gosh i need to get back to the hotel and then i got back to the hotel and i was like please can i have an early check-in and she checked my account and she was like okay fine have you can have an early check-in free of charge girl if she did not give me an early check-in free of charge the way i would have collapsed on that hotel floor because i am so exhausted it's mad the thing is i was so exhausted i couldn't i couldn't even vlog like i couldn't even vlog the way i wanted to vlog for you guys like that's so mad like hotel has been nothing but excellent so kind so accommodating to me and that's why I'm, i came back again 
Um, I made a poll on YouTube where I was like, do you guys want to see long Japan videos or shorter, like more quicker, 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 quicker out? And you guys picked the quicker out. So I'm not, I don't want to make the, this video too, too long. I'm just literally going to sleep for the rest of the day. I mean, if you guys want to watch me sleep, this is fine. It's completely fine. But I just find it a little bit weird, yeah? But yeah, all I'm going to do for the rest of the day, I promise you guys, is unpack. If you guys want to see more behind the scenes of things I get up to, don't forget to follow me on TikTok at 6 uisc Follow me on Instagram, 6 uisc and all my other socials are in the description below. And yeah, it's been your girl Louise. Thank you for following me to Japan. I couldn't do it without you. There's no way I could solo travel without you guys, honestly. So it was not easy, but we did it. I did it. What's our meme? I'm so tired. I forgot my memes. Oh my gosh. I normally have such a huge meme bank. I feel like I think I have a, a brain lobe of memes, but it's dead right now. Walked for it and I got it. I'm about to sleep. I'll see you guys in my next YouTube video. I'm definitely going to buy those shoes, but I just need to sleep on it. And yeah, thank you. Love you guys so, so much.